Hello. I hope everyone is doing fine through the times of our losses. And we pray that everything get better. And we know it's going to get better because everything has its seasons. You know, this is one of the times where it's written in the good is suffering for the bad. See, it's this thing called greed. Once again, everything has its seasons. Those who last shall be first, and those who first shall be last. And we're talking about, right now, a new change on life, period. See, you have to understand what's going on. See, when man do things out of hand, God comes in and he cleans up. He exposes everything. Only you will pay attention and observe and have knowledge. And see, we can say, we can guess, we can do all these things above. But do we really understand what's going on? You picked up a Bible, I don't care what religion you is. Get it, get it on, go online, go on Facebook. Read. Look at these chapters, it's all there. Big part of Revelation, but see... Man don't know when time in. He want to make time in. He want to eliminate. God put us all here for a purpose. It don't care who color or who you are. We're here. He's the only one to have control of that, not man. See, ignorance comes in many colors and forms and shapes. And right now, you're going to see all the ignorance that you, you cannot stomach through the trying times that we are going through. People are losing one another, friends, neighbors, loved ones. And then we still got stupidity out here. Once again, you're going to have those that <sighs> just won't do right. No matter what they see is going, it could be their last days and they still want to be stupid. I'm sorry if I say stupid offended you. Well, okay. Life is the precious thing that you can have. Some might have more than you, some might have less than you. But you got you. That's, that's an important key. And love yourself, then you can love others. So if you're throwing hatred or assuming or, or tempting to divide or being nasty and evil and all this, well, I'm sorry for you. Because that means, it tells me you, you, you don't know what love is. You can't love yourself. But it's not my job, not my responsibility, but... I'm going to send someone for you that who can. And he's the creator of all. See, once he finished, things change. See, sometimes man had to understand. You step back and you say your prayers. You be humble. Be thankful. Because there's always a power greater than yours. Now, see, if you know the key and you know who to call. See, I'm calling my daddy. Okay? See, you mess with me, I call my daddy. Now, see, you done mess with me. You done mess with the whole world. That's messing with me. Because it involves me. I'm part of this fallout. We all part of this fallout. So, I ask everybody. I don't care who you are, what you are, what religion you are. I would ask you just to call on him. Just pray. If we can all do it at one time. Oh, man, watch more mountains and move. See, things are moving because prayers are being answered. But we're going to unite these prayers in all religion, all nationalities. Stay strong. Remember, no matter what you do, we just rent this place. You think you that house and the cars and all that, that's rented. God gave you that. He can easily take it away. As you can see how things are going today.